Uh-oh, I've been to Sephora again. Hey everybody, Deborah here, also known as Dimage42. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to Tuesday Reviews. Now today, if you've been watching my Instagram, you might already have a guess as to what I'm going to talk about. And it's not this first item, just a quick talk about what I picked up. Sephora now has these little masks, clay masks and resealable little plastic packet thingy. I haven't gotten a chance to use it yet. I decided to pick it up just to see what it's like. We'll talk about that at some other time. The star of the show, the star of everything makeup y in my mind at this moment is some highlighter. And not just any highlighter. First, let me show you. Glasses off. Stepping in. Holy crap, is that blinding or what? And it's purple. I've also been using the highlighter as eyeshadow. Different colors of it. Hmm, who is putting out this pretty glowy, purpley stuff? Well, it's pretty much the queen bee of makeup and highlighters, and it's Anastasia. Now, I've been sort of wanting every time I go into Sephora this one Anastasia glow kit that has this blue color in it and I look at it and I think oh it's $44 and I only really want one color and I, and I just can't justify it so I go and look at it swatch it with my fingers and look at how pretty it is and walk away well the girl at the Sephora at JCPenney at Haywood Mall in Greenville I was telling her about that and she said oh I have something I think that is right up your alley it was sitting on the counter. They had not even put it on a shelf yet. And it's this pretty little guy right here. It's Moonchild Glow Kit by Anastasia Beverly Hills. And it is Moonchildy indeed. First, let's open her up. No mirror. You got your mirrors elsewhere, but this is nice sturdy packaging, magnetic closure, you know, the usual little plastic doohickey on top and you'll see some fallout in there because I have been using the fire out of this thing uh, but look at these colors we have got gorgeous this purple horseshoe is probably my favorite because you know purple there's also blue moon lucky clover and I'm not a wear and green kind of person but I had sort of a mint green um, sweater on yesterday I used some of that because it really acted like it reflected that color off of it and yeah I kind of liked it Pink Heart, Blue Ice, and Star. Star is sort of a silvery one. We'll do some swatch activity here. Let's, uh, okay, we got a nice white arm to show you on. First, purple horseshoe, first on the finger, wow. Looks a little bit subtle on there when you swatch it, but trust me, you get a brush in there and put a little extra on and it's gorgeous. Star, very silvery, very nice. Again, with the slightly subtle. Another clean finger. That one is blue ice, and it's kind of icy and blue. Let's put it over here. Easier to turn my arm that way. Pretty. Uh, running out of fingers. Blue moon, which is more blue than the uh, silvery one. Ooh, yes, yes. We'll use a thumb for Lucky Clover. Oh, look at that. It is so green and reflective, so pretty. Almost a duochrome action. And I'll have to switch hands because I'm out of clean fingers or I could, you know, just wash my hands. Okay, finally, Pink Heart. Hoo, hoo, hoo. We'll put it right in the middle there. No, they're not in order, no. I'm not a good swatcher, but it's okay. Look at the colors though. The colors really stand out a lot better in person than they do over my cell phone, which is how I record my videos. Um, they are so gorgeous on. I mean, look at this. Yes, it shows off some of the texture of my late 40s skin. I expected that. Anytime you use a powder, very reflective uh, highlighter, you're going to get that. But I don't care. It is so much fun. It is so glowy. The purple matches my hair. Um, yeah, I'm kind of loving it. The price point, well, just like all the Anastasia kits, it's a little over 40 bucks. 
but you have six very usable colors. And if you're like me, you're gonna use it for everything. I will practically do a whole face in this, except for, you know, foundation, but I've used it on my eyes, I use it on my cheeks, I've put it on top of lipstick just to give it a little extra glowy stuff. Um, it's super pretty. If you're a highlighter junkie like I have been lately, you'll love this one. And thank you to the young lady at that Sephora counter in JCPenney for showing me this because, well, it has been my obsession ever since you have. It has gotten used every single day. Um, and to show you how much you should actually get out of it for that, the pans hardly look touched, except for I've swatched them with my fingers just now. You can see my finger imprint in them. There's a good bit of product in here, so you're not gonna feel cheated in any way. Enjoy the glow, y'all. It's fun. Go visit my Instagram, link will be below, because there's a lot of uh, highlighter type pictures in there because you know, I'm kind of obsessed with it right now. Thanks for joining me for a review of uh, this glow kit. Oh my God. And um, come back every Tuesday for reviews on something. It's not always makeup. Up here, we've got a food review. Oh, please hit the subscribe button over here and I'll see you.